for practice it, self-check 2.27, how many lines? We are asked, what is the output of the following code? We have a for loop, and inside of here, we have int i is equal to 1, and then we have i less than equal to 3, i plus plus. So in here, we have code, we have print lines like this. And this loop is going to run once, twice, and then a third time because i is equal to 1. And then we increment i, so i isn't going to be equal to 2. And then we increment it again, and i is equal to 3. And then it runs that last time because i is less than or equal to 3. So the first time, while i is equal to 1, it's going to run and print out how many lines. Since there's no brackets for this for loop, it's only going to execute what's immediately under it. This is the only line, the, the line that's currently highlighted gray is the only thing that will execute because it's the only thing that the for loop will enclose without brackets. It only encloses the line directly underneath it. So it says how many lines, now i is equal to 2, it'll go through the loop again, how many lines i is now equal to 3, so it'll run through it again, how many lines, i is equal to 4, and since 4 is greater than 3, it will not execute, and we will break out of this loop and print our printed question mark. We can submit this, and we have passed the test. Again, the reason why this printed out three times and not our printed, and our printed did not print out three times, is because when there's no brackets around code that is encased in a for loop, a for loop only encases what's directly underneath it. And this is the reasoning for this output.